So you can download Instagram for the iPad as we all know, but it appears as an iPhone app and it's really small, blurry and just not optimised for the iPad. While Instagram could well be working on an app built for the iPad, there's actually a workaround now that allows you to get basically the web app in full screen on the iPad and uh, this web app allows you to check DMs, view your feed, it's, it's quite similar to the main Instagram app apart from a few different features missing. A similar method also applies to Windows and Mac as well. You can use a web app to get Instagram on them or simply download the Instagram app from the Windows Store. But we're going to be talking about iPad specifically today. So let's get started and move over to the iPad. Step one, go onto Safari and then go to the Instagram website. Now you can log in here if you want, it doesn't really matter. But what, what what you need to do next is tap the share icon and then go down and tap add to home screen. Then you can rename this what you want, obviously we want it to be called Instagram and then just tap add. You'll notice it appears down here and if you tap it, it actually opens in a full screen view. I need to log in so give me a moment. You can now see that we have quite a good way of uh, viewing Instagram on the iPad and we can view our posts as you can see here. We can view our direct messages as well and we can also view our explore feed and obviously notifications too it's also easy to view your profile whilst you're here there's an only downside you can't actually post from this app so it's a bit annoying but i think instagram will add this functionality uh, eventually but that's really how you get instagram on the ipad as optimized as this as it can be at the moment